Hey there. Let's take a moment and talk about Hasselblad central shutters. That's the shutter that's in the lens. Um, it's kind of interesting how this works. The camera body fires the shutter in the lens and the camera body winds the shutter that's in the lens or cocks it. And it does that through kind of an interesting mechanism. I'm going to dismount the lens now. I'm going to make sure that the body is wound. And I'm going to take the lens off and show you how this works. All right, you see this screw-shaped thing? That is the essentially the wind knob or the cocking knob for the shutter. And if you look in the body, there's a screwdriver shaped thing. See how that sticks out? That mates with this guy once the lens is mounted. And when you wind the body, that turns this screw, screwdriver-ish thing, and that turns this to cock the shutter. Now, um, you always need to make sure that before you mount a lens onto a body that they're both in the same state. Body wound, lens wound, uh, and the state needs to be wound. It can't be unwound. So, your body needs to be wound and your lens needs to be cocked before you put them together. What happens, though, if your shutter gets tripped? Just to demonstrate how that works, I'm going to accidentally trip my shutter while it's off the body. You hear that? That was the shutter tripping. So now, the position of this thing doesn't match the position in the body. The position of the shutter cocking mechanism doesn't match. So what do I do about that? Well, i got to manually cock the shutter. And to do that, I'm going to use this tool. I got this off of eBay. And it's specifically designed to do this. It's also specifically designed to be used for body jams. You can put it in this way. I'm not going to demonstrate that because I don't want to jam my body. Anyway, I'm going to use this little guy, and you can see on the back of the lens, there's a little arrow going in a clockwise direction. There's also a dot. My goal is to get this slot lined up with that dot by turning in the direction of that arrow, so I'm going to use this tool to do it. All right. These guys are lined up. The lens should be ready to mount. Make sure I get it in the right orientation. Come, slides right on. And I should be able to now fire the body. There it goes. Everything's good. So that's how you recock your lens and a little bit on. Um, what to look out for when mounting a body to a lens, etc.